everyone how are you i hope that you all are fine so in our previous video we discussed some point related this chapter so let's move further so i to start it from here the invention of magnifying lenses led to the di uh, discovery of the microscopic world it is no it is now known that a single cell may be constitute a whole organism as in amoeba it means uh, the invention of magnifying lenses lead to the discovery of the microscopic world it is no uh, it is now known that uh, um, that a single cell may be constitute a whole organism like amoeba bacteria many more Chlamydomonas, Paramecium, and bacteria. This is these organisms are called unicellular organisms. These organisms are called uni unicellular organisms. Uni means single. Uh, it means uh, these are organisms which made up of only one cell. It means single cell. That's why it is called unicellular organism. Okay. On the other hand. many cells group together in a single body as and assume different function in function in it to form various body part in multicellular organism multi means many such as some fungi plants and animals uh, it means uh, in uh, on the other hand many cells group uh, it means uh, it says that uh cell cell uh, many cells combine together and uh, form tissue and uh, many tissue combine together tissue tissue combine together to form uh, what organ and uh, we know that organ organ combine together to form organ system and uh, organ system combine together to form organelles okay multicellular organelles like uh, like such as uh, some fungi plants and animals okay multicellular means many cell and unicellular means single cell can we find out uh, names of some more unicellular organisms yes uh, there are uh, many example of uh, unicellular organism like uh, you can say cyanobacteria mycoplasm okay and there uh, many more Every multicellular organism has come from a single cell. It means uh, every multicellular organism come from a single cell. They started from their life from a single cell. Okay? How cells divide to produce cell to uh, their own kind? All cell thrush comes from pre-existing cell. Now we know that cell arise from the process of pre-existing cell. Okay. We started. Ah, uh, and now here, here is some activity. Here is activity. Now from here we start. Some organism can also have single have uh, cells of different kinds. Look at the following picture. It is pick some cells from the human body. Here is some picture of uh, various cell from uh, the human body. Okay, so smooth muscle cell. This one is smooth muscle cell, blood cell, nerve cell, ovum, ah, uh, bone cell, sperm, and uh, fat cell. Ah, uh, these are the various uh, cell from the human body. Okay, now. further the shape and size the shape and size of cell are related to the speci sorry specific function they perform shape and size are also depend to sorry 
सेप एंड साइज और सेप एंड साइज ऑफ सेल आर रिलेटेड टू द स्पेसिफिक फंक्शन दे परफॉर्म इट मीन्स दे आर मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ मेनी शेप ऑफ सेल एंड डिफरेंट डिफरेंट सेप एंड साइज विच परफॉर्म डिफरेंट डिफरेंट फंक्शन इट ऑल्सो डिपेंड ऑन देयर शेप एंड साइज ओके सम सेल्स लाइक अमीबा हैव चेंजिंग शेप सम सेल लाइक अमीबा हैव चेंजिंग शेप अमीबा हैव चेंजिंग शेप ओके इन सम केसेस द सेल शेप कुड बी मोर और लेस फिस्ड एंड पर्टिकुलर फॉर अ पर्टिकुलर टाइप ऑफ सेल फॉर एग्जाम्पल नर्व सेल हैव अ टिपिकल सेल इट मीन्स इन सम केसेस द सेल शेप कुड बी मोर और लेस फिक्सड एंड पिकुलर फॉर्म अ पर्टिकुलर टाइप ऑफ सेल फॉर एग्जाम्पल नर्व सेल हैव अ टिपिकल सेल ओके टिपिकल सेप सॉरी टिपिकल सेप इस लिविंग ऑर्गेनाइज इस लिविंग ऑर्गेनाइज इस लिविंग सेल सॉरी इस लिविंग सेल हैज द कैपेसिटी टू टू परफॉर्म सर्टेन बेसिक फंक्शन दे दैट दैट आर करेक्टरिस्टिक फॉर अ सॉरी ऑफ अ लिविंग फॉर्म्स Each living cell has the capacity to perform certain basic function that are tra- sorry characteristics of a living form. How does how does a living how does a living cell perform these basic function? How does the living cell uh, perform bas- uh, their basic function? we know that uh, there is a division of uh, labor in uh, multicellular organisms such as human beings uh we know that uh, there, uh, there is a, a, dif- a division of uh, labor in multicellular organisms such as uh, human beings there are uh, there are uh, many types of uh, can means there are uh, many cells divided from uh, to perform a uh, different different types of function such as human beings this means this means that different parts of the human body perform different function a uh, different part of <coughs> the body human body perform different types of function that uh, the human body has a heart to pump blood uh, we have a heart to pump uh, blood okay and uh, our stomach to digest food and so on and we have we also have stomach to digest food and uh, many more similarly division of labor is also seen within a single cell uh similarly division of labor is also seen uh, within a what unicellular organism it means uh, with a single cell in fact uh, each in fact uh, each such cell has in fact each such cell has got certain specific component within it known as a cell organelle uh, in fact each in fact each such cell has got certain specific component within within it known as cell organelle cell organelle they are in a cell there are many types of cell organelle are present they and uh, they also are like uh, mitochondria produce atp they are many function cell organelle are also do many types of function okay each kind of cell organelle perform a specific function each kind of cell organelle perform a 
uh, special function like uh, mitochondria play a uh, important role in uh, cell and ribosome also uh, protein synthesis such as uh, making new material in the cell and uh, such as making new material in the cell clean, uh, cleaning up the wasted material from the cell and so on and uh, also cleaning up uh, wasted material from the cell they are also present like vacuole lysosome also okay and so on a cell is able to uh, live and uh, perform all its function because of their organelles uh, a cell is able to live and perform all its function because of this organelle uh, these organelles are very important to to uh, to to help uh, it help to cell uh, it helps to cell uh, live and uh, perform uh, many types of function all its function okay because of this cell organelles these organelles together constitute the basic unit called the cell these organelles organelles together constitute a basic unit called the cell okay it is uh, it is interesting that all cells are found to have the same organelles it is interesting that all cells are found to have same organelles no no matter no matter what their function is uh, or what organelles they have found in okay uh, it uh, it uh, it is it means all uh, cell have uh, uh, same organelles and uh, no matter no matter what their function or what organelles they are in okay or again or um, all cell organelles are same in every cell okay so what is a cell made up of what is a cell made up of what is the structural organization of a cell okay we saw above that the cell has a special components called organelle uh, in uh, above we see that uh, cell have uh, special cell has a special component la component like uh, cell organelle organelles called cell organelles how how is a cell organized how is the cell organized if we study a cell under a microscope we would came sorry we would come across three features in almost in uh, almost uh, in, in almost every cell like uh, plasma membrane nucleus and cytoplasm these are the uh, same what if we uh, study cell under a microscope we can uh, we would come across three features almost almost like uh, uh, what plasma membrane nucleus and cytoplasm and cytoplasm all activity inside the cell and interaction of uh, the cell within oh uh, sorry with its environment are possible due to these features at uh, uh, all activity 
All activities inside the cell are interaction of uh, the cell within its environment are possible due to this feature. What are these features? Plasma membrane, nuclear, cytoplasm and also cell membrane, cell wall also sorry. So here are the, let us see how. First one is plasma membrane, you can also say cell, man, cell membrane and uh, next one is cell wall, nucleus, cytoplasm, okay. So I hope you understand all the video. That's all for today. Thank you. Have a nice day.